So he walks down there, and this is where I knew it. Whoever is in control of this operation ain't with the games. Because mm. tell me why it pans past three ape kebabs just sitting in the <laughs> middle of the yard. Ape kebabs, dog. That is wild. Three ape kebabs with the Jordan mean face is fucking That is wild, wild. bro. <laughs> Not even wrong. <laughs> oh, three ape kebabs is cold work, bro. What's going on, Clitch? What? What up, what up, what up? Shit, what up? It's Shibo Ross. And we in the clutch, baby. Hey. Back to you, ladies and gentlemen, with another video today. You feel me? All right, we're going to check out when Godzilla and Kong showed everyone why they run the MonsterVerse. Godzilla. Y'all know Kong, what time it is. Yeah. They, they them niggas. Yeah. They them niggas, man. And then uh, we, uh, me and Dub got to ch uh, check out the, the movie when it did drop and whatnot. And it was enjoyable. You know, you're there for the monster fights. That's mm -hmm. what you're really there for. You, you're there to see the fades, and it was cool to see Kong try to get used to the world, you know, the middle of the earth, and try to find his family. And then, you know, things started happening. We don't want to spoil it for those who hadn't seen it already. It was definitely enjoyable for sure. You yeah, know? yeah, yeah, no, nah, for Especially sure. Especially towards towards the end, it's just chaos. <laughs> it's just just chaos. Monsters fighting with all types of powers. You're here for it, but we but, all know. That's what I was gonna say we was we was there for it though. We, yeah, we couldn't we wait. All, yeah, we all know Godzilla and Kong. They run this shit, and they had to let these other monsters know we we run this shit. So we're gonna check this out. Should be a good one. Let's do this damn thing, man. Appreciate this up. So it starts, and Kong over here playing tug of war with this Pokemon for some good eats. But then bro heard this roar and was like, "Do my, my eyes, eyes deceive me?" me? Yeah. <laughs> Man took this as a challenge. Boy said, I know fools ain't pushing pain on my turf. This Skull Island. Y'all must ain't see my movie. I put this hood on the map. Cole <laughs> pulled up to scope the scene. But this whole time, it was just this little frog creature over here set tripping. Mm -hmm. Cone pulled up to this Minecraft ravine with this diamond pickaxe. Think he finna go farm some minerals. Bro looked down and knew he was about to get some enchanted diamond armor. He landed and saw the ape-shaped skulls. Man's look flabbergasted. Like his name gonna be next in somebody's bio. It must have been some of his Dog. dead homies from way back. Cone walked through this waterfall and entered a whole new biome. But this place already on timing. You got this Kevin Durant shadow dude <laughs> walking up on bro. Man's phone squared up immediately. Can't never catch bro lacking no more yeah, after facts. them beatdowns Godzilla put on him in the last oh, movie. Pause it. But looks are deceiving. Mm -hmm. That's true. If you haven't seen the movie, because <laughs> you were talking about no spoiler, but if you haven't seen the yeah. movie, yeah, you might not want to watch this video. Yeah, you sorry. Know, <laughs> yeah, it definitely does spoil it for you. So may want to go back, watch the movie. I think it's, a, is it on like HBO Max or something like that now? I'm not sure. I think it is streaming now. You can go watch the movie now and then come back and check this out later. So hey, I never seen this movie. Hey, it click was... off, Jeff. Just you know, just take a break for how long is this video? It's uh, only sixteen minutes. Not oh, you... damn. But yeah, <laughs> it was just little Diddy Cone. Cone tried to dap bro up out of respect. Yeah, but Diddy was like, "Oh heck no!" Nah. and bit that boy oh. Cone on the finger <laughs> like he was taking a chump out of a glizzy. Hey, and he yo. gonna run away. Man's just pulled the weakest hit and run I've ever seen in my life because no. all it took was five strides and Cone was about to two step on the back of little man's head. Cone got high alert on though because mm -hmm. soon as he entered that other section, somebody dropped behind him. Ugh. Or should I say something? Because I know this not Hobo. no ape. Bro, it looked like somebody <laughs> took Caesar from Planet of the Apes DNA and tried to cook up a Kong clone in the test tube. <laughs> but OG Kong over here like, oh, they done took Hobo. my guy to great clips. They skipped all the formalities though, and two ox spirit Kong mushing his head into the ground. But Kong down here like, wait, hold up, my name is in the movie title. It's Yo. up for y'all. He slammed this rock against bro's head, turning his brain into pudding. And somebody called Dana White. We got your next star, cause we got apes pulling off rear naked chokes now. But his man's over here team killing and caved his head in just to catch an overhead to his spine. Team Ooh, killing. Boy. I know bro gonna be feeling that tomorrow. Catching a two-ton hammer fist to your back will put anybody down. Smooth Brain wanted to get his get back though and tried to sneak Kong. But dude caught this Flintstone bone and looked at bro like, Flintstone this not bone. your body, my G. 
booming him into his little homie. Now Thing 1 tried to end Cone's career with that enchanted battle axe, but caught a leg bone to the bottom of his chin. Both had to eat liquid banana after that lit. While trying to receive his liquid strap, banana. Diddy Kong pulled up on Lil Rascal time and tried to reorganize oh. Kong's face. Lil Man thought it was sweet and got turned into a melee weapon. One. Two, three, three goofy <laughs> niggas that funny, he did use what him as a weapon, dog. He started beating his ass with the, with the little homie. That shit was that shit was funny, dog. He beating it. Hey, even kids catch the <laughs> Kong kids. Hey, nobody was spared, bro. Nobody was spared. Down, bro. Kong really squat wiping these doodle bobs. Man is a solo cue menace. And these must be some short bus apes, cause they not learning their lesson. Bro caught a hook to his noggin, and he's out for the count. Short Mark, bus apes. Up talking to Kobe, trying to figure out how to be the same animal and a different beast. R.P. Black Mamba. But Rest why Kong going devious timing? Bro really down smash bro's back end. Even if he lives this fade, he gonna have scoliosis for life now. But Kong still not done. Like what? What's wrong, these fools monkey? must got him in the hole. He lifts bro's head. What's wrong, monkey? <laughs> I didn't see never miss, dog. Oh my god! I missed that video. Scramble his teeth around, and it took a sneak attack from his homie to stop Kong from turning his head into mashed potatoes. <gasps> Kong really a real nigga, just trying to find some real homies is all. But bro, right here, he really deserved his fate. Cause how you mm -hmm. gonna get saved and instantly get back Yo, to bro. home? Yeah. Kong parried that attack and told bro to Parry. this. Is Skull Island, nigga. And Sparta kicked him off the ledge. The Caesar clone knew it was up and tried to skedaddle like the spot. Cone picked up this rock, decided to show off his QB skills. Man's really all pro in this throwing jump. He tossed a hell Mary. He did way hit in that the ball, bro. Don't man bro in the back of his neck just because he felt like it. This goofy cone really petty for real. He know dang well that was unnecessary. Then he had to keep up the bad cop act. Pulling out little Diddy Kong over here bush camping like he in Fortnite. Booming him on his shoulder trying to get him to ah. drop the location of the ops. Little bro was like, alright, dang bro. It ain't even that serious. So Kong and his sidekick pulled up to the spot. Kong looking like Phantom when he finds out all he got left to eat is some salad. He like, MLK <laughs> didn't die for this. Slavery in my hood? Yeah. Oh, heck Hell. nah. So he walks down there and this is where I knew it. Whoever is in control of this operation ain't with the games because mm. tell me why it pans past three eight kebabs just sitting in the three middle of the eight kebabs dog that is wild three eight kebabs with the jordan mean face is that is wild bro wild. not even on <laughs> Oh, Three eight kebabs is cold work, bro. Yard, like what y'all doing? Y'all just don't see this? This is clearly an act of Black Air Force energy. We dealing with a real psychopath, ain't it? Cone sees one of the yard commanders harassing someone and slid in for a talk. Yepatron came in spitting all kinds of hot fire on bro's face. So Cone slapped some CTE across his jaw so he won't forget to brush his teeth next time. And then started banging on his chest, letting them know. He not here for all talk and no action. Yeah. After that display of outright aggression, the Titan yeah. Reaper himself is revealed. Skull King. Man's posing on the throne with all this spiritual pressure. And from mm -hmm. this beast Titan build, I knew Kong was finna take his first L of the movie. Yeah. And bro's eyes are crystal blue. Yeah. Nigga got that Gojo effect. I'm not even sure if Kong the main character anymore. Dude no. walks out punking all yeah. the apes. And he is literally on anime character timing. I wouldn't be surprised if he hit a flash step and popped the you domain expansion. That's what it looked like you were about to do. Yeah. <laughs> Got Kong looking up like, oh dang, he looking kind of comfy. Scar came down, sizing Kong up, even sticking his grimy hands all over Kong's VBS grill. Yeah. And this is where we see Bro's griminess on VBS. display. While everyone laughing, Bro got tight with little Diddy Kong for bringing Bro here. But his big homie was like, chill, Scar. It ain't that serious. Scar like, yeah, you right. Looking Kong dead in the face. Before he drop kids bro dead into a pool of time to meet Jesus. Oh, that yeah. was cold, bro. It's, a, Kong it's time here. to meet Scar Jesus. Ain't no hope. Clear it, clear it. They finna bang out. Both these menaces yep. strap up and the scrubs start dropping the fight music. <laughs> Scar swings that bone whip at Kong. And man's really weave nation with that dodge. He started feeling himself trying to grab the whip like this mug not laced with jagged edges. 
Got his hand looking like the roof of my mouth when I eat Captain Crunch. <laughs> right here is where Kong has his first nigga moment. He rushed in, got weaved twice with ease. Scar moving like he been training for this all his life. Then he parries the battle axe, weaving out to give Kong a little love tap on his shoulder. Kong <laughs> thought he was Weave too. Nation and Sneaker Nation certified, but called him uppercut instead. Scar on arm, bro, then put him into one of those Auntie Anne's pretzel knots choking him. Kong saw a little Diddy looking at him and was like, I ain't finna be grits today. Hitting that Uno reverse, then slammed Scar on his spleen, but bro was starving. So he ate that jump and called off his jumper nigga unit. And Kong, yeah. I'm gonna be real. Unit. It might be chalk uh. for you, bro. Dude just ate a Batista bomb and then posed like a JoJo's <laughs> character. It turns out, bro not just enslaving apes, but even legendary Pokemon. Yeah. Man, think he's ass catch him. <laughs> now we get introduced to this menace Shimo. Scar uses that crystal to make Shimo attack Kong with that spearmint breath. He barely escapes spearmint. that first blast, grabbing his axe, blocking the second one. But this jump got an AOE effect, turning his hand into a popsicle. Yep. Right before Kong finna yep. get sent to the gulag, Diddy Kong show him the escape route so he doesn't get turned into Italian ice. He got Scar <laughs> over here with his strap. That's like the equivalent of getting your chain snatched by a random nigga. Yep. This jump low key not fair though. Bro's build is too OP. Man's is a demigod build with a one shot monster pit. <laughs> so Kong yep. pulled up to Egypt. Bro came out the portal gripping the pyramids with this infinity gauntlet. Man <laughs> gets one upgrade and thinks he's Thanos. But Godzilla <laughs> wasn't with the games. Nope. Niggas pulling up on his turf? Ain't gonna cut it. Dude stood up like he finna put LLK. Long live Kong in some no. wild. The tell you bro has a play stretch build. They got man's looking too athletic. Kong threw up his set because he ain't no hope. Godzilla said, all right, bet. You think I'm playing? I'm, I'm pulling, pulling up, up on you, nigga. nigga. And goes into the ocean like Mike Phelps. Bro, Godzilla really a crash out, to be honest. Dude yeah. got dissed one time, and now he thinks it's cool to casually tarnish thousands of civilians in his domestic violence against Kong. Man seeing care, red bro. and start seeing all. freak everybody. Godzilla jumped out that water and started pressing Kong. But Kong realized mid-press that he really came to just get help for bro to beat Scar and Shimo. <laughs> he like, hey, bro, chill, chill. Yeah, he we got a common op game. Godzilla was like, freak all oh, that. And tackled bro like he was Aaron Donald. <laughs> Nigga eradicated thousands oh, of like years Aaron worth Donald. of world history with the pyramid. Yeah. Right. Because you have no respect, bro. I tell you. Got Kong over here posted up, rethinking his current situation. <laughs> but bro locked in, though, and threw some grime in Godzilla's <laughs> eyes. Mans ran noggin first into another pyramid. He like, oh, man. <laughs> that was weak. And started throwing a tantrum. And what happens next? literally makes this movie s tier in the fight category bro press kong against the wall and has to remind everyone that his name hold weight he picks up kong and i'm talking feet off the ground Dog, type he jump. Did, then he bro. hit bro with that kaiju suplex with the little kong arms a dose of instant cte after that boom like what are they feeding these niggas bro i would have never thought there would be a day i see my twin kong get boomed on his spinacus but kong is a get back guru i tell you that Bro loaded up that Infinity Gauntlet, sending a nuke into Godzilla jaw. Fool really got one shot at it. Is this really y'all goat? Because my nigga Kong doing him the worst way. I can't lie. I never let another nigga have me on my back, but that's just me. But Kong not done with bro and puts him in a combo extender, then spams him with heavy attacks, laced with concussion stones from that Infinity Gauntlet, putting that boy to sleep. Concussion stone. Man, really got humble for real. Need to change his name to Godzilla with a lowercase g. He's a little god for real. Kong over here dragging bro to another phase like he just handled some lightweight. But he heard that infamous charge up. Yep, and yep. it was finna be Crash Out City in this mug. Kong looked back like Godzilla really weak for real. Got to pull out the blast breath every time he finna lose a fight. Man's ain't trying to throw no hands for real. He don't know uh, struggle. He got like three Zenkai boosts in this yeah. movie alone in his five minute cameo. That blast breath made a smoke screen, clearing the way for this spear to the gut. Then he curb stomps Kong into the earth, charging up another easy way for Kong to see his dead homies. Right here, I thought it was up for Kong. Man's really finna get crisped up into some pork rinds from this radioactive lizard. Well, at least until this moth kaiju showed up to recruit them for the anti-scar campaign. Look at it. Two ops made friends about to stand on business. So we switched to a new fade scenery. And that Scar came calm. in destroying junk like he owned the place. I'm talking one, two, three, four, multiple goofies deep. And think he's gonna <laughs> run some pockets. But all we hear in the background is 
<laughs> and what do we know? Two real niggas have arrived. My boy Kong and Frazilla came out the smoke, hauling booty towards Scar and Shimo. I know these fools would have gave you same boat a run for his money. I can't lie though. This scene of two monkeys riding in on these legendary Pokemon, <laughs> Chef's Kiss. Whoever cooked this up, yeah, they need a raise. So two right before Kong was finna put Scar on layaway, the gravity reset, inverting all their settings. Now they fighting in the air, and Kong is about to get dead dirty. Cause Scar is in the assassin class with the movement. Man's flipping from rock to rock and initiating a fade with circle spams. Bro, wrap <laughs> Kong up and put five Bro. toe jams into his mouth. And look at Frozilla over here not holding his weight, getting hit with that spearmint beam. Got the moth shot saving his man. But he came out the ice on timing, literally swimming through the air to crash out on Shimo. The gravity starts to get a new update, and all the kaiju begin to fall back into the earth realm portal. No. No. Scar and Shimo came out that portal like they had black air forces on. While Shimo over here making the next Ice Age move with IRL, Scar over here celebrating like he already had the dub. He like, yeah, this my hood now. Mm. But Kong popped that fade stone in his gauntlet. <laughs> the fade stone. Sleep. Bro got up and spit a building sized tooth out his mouth. Got Kong like, dang. I really rocked that nigga. Even Fryzilla hit a point blank blast breath at Shimo gut. Now this fade then turned into a bang out session. These kaiju really going lick for lick in this fade. And now I guess Kong done realized it. Bro looked inside this building and saw the humans in turmoil and was like, dang, we really be trampling on these fools yeah, when we be throwing them. hands, don't we? And <laughs> it's nothing. about time, bro. I thought these casual homicides these kaiju was committing on humankind would go unnoticed. Shimo came in charging at Kong, but Godzilla spirit broke just to get tossed aside like the Elite Sox Spirits combo after 2016. It pans back to Hollow Earth where Lil Diddy Kong done found Kong's battle axe. Right here, I knew the bang out session was coming to an end because if this axe gets used, somebody's getting greased. Scar grabs a building and throws it at Kong, but after well, blocking it, he gets flip kicked into a combo where Shimo is mushing his face into the city, giving him that Broly treatment. But while this grimy behavior is taking place, Godzilla renews his Sneaky Nation badge and charges up a final flash. Man's think he's Vegeta. Scar looks back in huh? disbelief. Bro is huh? baffled at this sight, mm -hmm. but before he gets sent back to the lobby, he pulls the <laughs> exquisite weave out his bag. He slung that whip at Godzilla, and bro catches it, looking at him yep. like, I might not be a gorilla, but I got that gorilla <laughs> grip. <laughs> then he what booms bro on his back <laughs> and breaks his strap. Man's finna get exposed without his melee weapon. Oh, Meanwhile, bro. Kong over here fighting the Sub-Zero variant, and yep. he's losing. Mm -hmm. But Godzilla comes in with a third party, biting bro's <laughs> neck. This gave Kong just enough time to recoup. But before he could get right, Scar pressed him. Then here comes a familiar scene. My guy is getting put in yet another <laughs> rear naked choke. Like, bro, I know you done at least came up with a counter for that by now. Dog. He pans back. And Diddy Kong dragging his behind into frame with Kong's axe. Kong gave him that look like, do it for the gang, little bro. Kong big dudes on. Ow. Probably gonna have to talk to that boy Magic Johnson after that blood hit his system. Oh, but bad. Diddy Kong hit that little move and broke the crystal, sending everybody flying back. Scar gets up and grabbed Diddy Kong by his neck just to catch a haymaker to his jaw. <laughs> and here's another example of peak cinema. Kong grabbed bro and was like, I'm sorry for what we're about to do to you. And throws him at Godzilla, who yep. then tail whips him back at Kong, playing ping pong with Bro's body. Kong holds him up for the finishing blow, and Shimo comes to his senses like, shoot, let me get in on this. No. And his bro with that spearmint beam cannon. Got dude's body on thin ice while Kong is gripping him by the neck. Then Kong had to go ahead and put him down. Jumping off this building from max height to obliterate Scar across the rubble. These kaiju getting out of hand, bro. They getting athletic and they acquiring weapons of mass destruction. Like who they fighting next? Cause these goofies looking mighty OP. Hey, y'all know what to do. Smash that like button, comment and subscribe. This was great, bro. That was definitely funny, bro. Nigga say he put in that. What do you say? The fade uh stone. Fade gone, man. The fade stone, man. Hey, they packed that nigga up at the end. It's yeah, eight, bro. Man. Once uh, Shimo was like, hey, wait a minute. Oh, oh, oh you can't control me no more? Oh, shit. I'm about to. <laughs> I'm, about to... I'm about to <laughs> turn that nigga into an ice cube. <laughs>
<laughs> froze that nigga to Jeez. death. <laughs> Jeez. Oh yeah. man. Nah, that this is definitely a dope, bro. This is a definitely a, a dope movie. Um, kind of make me mm-hmm. want to go back and check it out again, man. Mm-hmm. There was a lot of fight scenes. It was entertaining. Um, so yeah, definitely. If y'all enjoyed it, y'all already know what to do. Make sure with the likes, mm-hmm. keep on supporting us. Not only us, but the homie to put the video together. Make sure y'all go mm-hmm. check out his video. His channel. Link to the original yep. video is down below. Keep on supporting us, spreading love, being love. Catch y'all in the next one. Peace out. Already. This bitch is from Houston. If she got a problem, then we got the solutions. And there's no illusion. I made this shit happen. I'm living life lucid. I'm switching my strategies. Now they hate on me because I'm causing casualties. But why are they after me? Deep inside, they know they can't handle half of me.